La 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 la. Are you ready for another Outrider video? Excellent, because today we're going to be bringing you the Canoptic Harvest. What is that? Ah, ha, ha, you'll like it. Here we go. Floating, scuttling, and ghosting through the blasted ruins of burning worlds, the Canoptic Constructs harvest the living and the dead. Sometimes, an overlord will gather together his robotic underlings and set them the specific task of scouring the battlefield for resources. Their mechanical minds, slaved to the artificial intelligence of a canoptic spider, the swarm of constructs becomes a harvest. Feeding on the fallen, the swarm converts mortal remains into energy for the overlord, with little thought to whether or not the fallen try and resist. If the harvest is challenging, then the canoptic spider reacts using a plethora of adaptive subroutines, allowing them to better focus on self-repair speed, or rendering down anything unfortunate enough to fall under their clanking metal mandibles. Nice, huh? So let's see what that means. What that means is this is a formation of one canoptic spider, one unit of canoptic wraiths, and one unit of canoptic scarabs. When you do that, there are no other restrictions. So you just, wow, a spider, a unit of wraiths, and a, and a unit of scarabs. You can have as many of those formations as you want, um, regardless of uh, a force allocation chart, because it's a separate formation. You get that, and the, and the formation will get the following special rules. They all have move through cover. They all become relentless. And they have a special rule called adaptive subroutines. At the start of each of the controlling player's movement phases, choose one of the following special rules. Fleet, reanimation protocols, or shred. Holy shit. Yeah, okay. The Canoptic Spider from this formation and all units from this formation within 12 in inches of the Canoptic Spider from this formation <laughs> benefit from the effects of the chosen special rule until the start of the controlling player's next movement phase. So it does last a whole turn. Wow. So, uh, basically, you know, it's all based upon the Canoptic Spider. You, well, that's what it says. Fleet, reanimation protocols, or shred. And if you have multiple formations, you can have each one picking a different, a different subroutine. Wow. And also, remember, they get, they get moved through cover. So, that makes the fleet uh, particularly helpful now. That is kind of awesome. Try out that army if you want to see something interesting. Until next time. Bye.